In this video I'm going to show you how to change the syllabus or course information. Um, as you remember I changed the syllabus uh, tool into the course information tool and I'm going to click on that and right now there's nothing in there so I'm going to add something so I'll just click add um, and this is where I'm going to put course information so give it a title and down here I would like to copy and paste um, some text that I have now um, I have a document that I would like to try to use so let me bring that onto the screen here this is a Microsoft Word document and it has different sections that I think are helpful it's got links in it, it's got the formatting the way I'd like um, so what I might want to do is just um, copy it all so I'm can control A, control C to to select it all and then copy it um, and then try to paste it into here paste now uh, this isn't going to work very well um, if I scroll down to the bottom and uh, try to hit post yeah we're had a problem here and the problem is is that it says error we had all these tags and, and so, you know what happened here why wasn't that a clean copy and paste why didn't it work and the reason is is that when you copy and paste something in from Microsoft Word even if it's only a single word it oftentimes has lots and lots and lots of junk code on the back end um, and so the problem is that's what we're running into if we look at the source um, and anywhere you have HTML on the site you could always click source you'll notice that um, even before we get to the first word we've got all of this code that Microsoft Word sticks in there. In fact, you can see how much of this is code that needs to be deleted. So before we even get to the first line, um, there is a whole lot of code that needs to go. It's probably, if you look here where we are, it's more than half of it. So the best way of getting rid of this is to, let me um, delete that, or rather select all and delete that. Um, if I want to paste in from something Word, there's a little button here that says Paste from Word, which is nice. You can click there, paste everything in, and then click OK. And now when we go to save it, there we go, it's all set. Um, so we can preview and see what this looks like. So this is from the student point of view, and this is it. It's got an overview, objectives and goals, grading policy, kept our links the way we like them, and everything's all set there for the syllabus or the course information, as the case may be.